What's for snack? Jack attack. Over the past few weeks, I've realized some of my friends don't know how to cut pineapples, so today we're doing a tutorial. You cut off the tops and bottom, and then you want to go in a circle and trim around the outer pieces. It's okay to have a little bit of the eyes still left on the pineapple, but you don't want any of the rough parts left. The pineapple has a thick fibrous core, so what you want to do is you want to cut it in half and then in quarters so that you have easy access to the inside core. To remove the core, I like to lay it down on one side, one of the flat sides, and then angle cut. I learned this a long time ago by watching Rachel Ray cut apples. Shout out to all my friends that watched Food Network as a kid growing up. The secret to eating pineapple without hurting your tongue is soaking it in salt water for at least half an hour. I'm not sure if this is just a Chinese thing or a my family thing, but we always did that. And of course you need lime and tahine for your pineapple. Look at it all dressed and ready to go. Personally, after putting tahine, I also like to put cayenne pepper, but since I'm sharing this with my kids, I will hold back on that. I love the contrast of sweet, spicy, sour, and salty. That's all, bye!